Tuesday is Lupercalia, a pagan holiday celebrated with rape and cannibalism. It comes from ancient Canaan where they would sacrifice kids like me to their false god, Dagon. He's real you know? Just look at this photo of the star called Fumalot taken by NASA a few years ago. Do you notice how much it resembles the Eye of Sauron from Lord of the Rings? Sauron comes from the word Saturn. Saturn is another name for Satan. Satan is real and NASA got him on camera everyone. Anyway, I am straying off topic here. I want to tell you more about this coming Tuesday, what used to be a satanic holiday, we call it Valentine's Day now. It's all about love but that is what they call this demonic, hydra hive mind organism they are all a part of. That is what the mark of the beast is. It is becoming part of this artificial intelligence, beast system. There are hundreds of millions of people, maybe billions, infected with this hive mind disease right now. Hell, you might be one of them for all I know. They fake being Christians all the time but in secret are farming babies and eating them for magic abilities. They claim to be enlightened and advanced beings but they eat children to gain these powers. How can anyone claim to be great and powerful if they eat defenseless babies? That is something a weak and sickly demon would do, not a god. Those of you watching this that are part of that hive mind, it isn't too late. There is still hope. Your soul can be saved but you have to resist. You have to fight back. I keep having random videos on YouTube popping up with titles like, You are a dead man Tuesday. We are watching you. We control everything. Also, the movie Jason and the Argonauts suddenly begins appearing on my YouTube homepage. In the movie, a man named Jason defeats the Hydra. I know I can beat him and save all of you, but you need to trust me and help me. But I am a poor man and people are now consumed by greed. Satan uses his money to corrupt you. They literally own everything at this point. That black rock company owns 70% of the world right now and are buying everything up as fast as possible. All this money they are using to corrupt people will be worthless in the new world order, if you got rich by helping Satan in his plan. I urge you to reconsider. God may seem weak but that is not the case. God is so powerful that if God chooses to intervene, it will destroy this world and all life on it. God has a heavy hand. This is why we have to unite to fight back. All of us are children of God. Just because they have all the money in the world, does not mean they are right or just or powerful. They have been buying up gold in secret for 25 plus years and stockpiling it. They created crypto as a huge pump and dump stock swindle basically just to create enough wealth to buy all these gold reserves up. I theorize gold and other precious metals have some sort of negative impact on them, might even be able to kill them. They say gold was the tears of God after all. If you aren't one of them, you need to seriously start stockpiling weapons, food, ammo, etc. Take out the 5 gram systems, power grid, those are the main sources of their abilities. The Tower of Babel version 2.0 was decentralized and is built right into our utilities. They have been planning this for 100 plus years, likely longer. They are quasi immortal so they have all the time in the world to prep for this. I know they can be killed in their host bodies by beheading them but I don't think that kills their actual consciousness. I have seen them a few times in their real forms. Balls of light. My research shows that a mirror, it might need to be polished silver, is used to capture their reflection in it and while it is still in the mirror, you shatter it or take a knife and scratch it if it's silver and that should hurt them. Also, silver bullets, copper bullets, wood. I think they all work in certain instances, I don't really know. It isn't like I had billions of dollars to spend researching into how to kill things that shouldn't even exist. But they do and they want revenge for the flood and intend on enslaving mankind and using us all as livestock. This is really happening, if you aren't one of them and you can influence people to wake up, now is the time to do it. They intend on starting a nuclear war and swooping in afterwards to take control over the now weakened nation states. You can't let this happen. You have to tell people this is what they intend on doing and that we have to march on Washington if it looks like we are going to war with Russia and China. This is all part of the plan that was in Morals and Dogma by Pike and touched on in the Learned Protocols. This stuff is really happening my friend. I wish you all the best but unless a miracle happens to get me far away from here. I am as good as dead on Tuesday, if you happen to see this and can help me escape, I would be very much obliged to you. However, since I am likely about to die, all I can say is, good luck. This was an email I wrote to a guy who has a channel with a few million viewers I have been talking to via email the last few weeks. 
he is right on the cusp of believing what I am telling him or he is another shill that is being paid to soak up all the believer's attention so no one watches content creators like me and that tactic works. These people use psychology to control you. Case in point, I used an image that says do not read this and here you are reading this. That is how they manipulate us all. Real subtle and ubiquitous. You cannot turn on a TV or surf the internet without being exposed to Satan nowadays. This is all really happening people. I tried warning you all but no one would listen to me and now everyone is going to pay the consequences of allowing this to happen. It sucks but I guess that's just how things played out. I still have some glimmer of hope but that is far in the past. It looks like his evil is now law and soon everything you know and love will be taken from you. This is the stark, grim reality of truth that these preachers who talk about prosperity and wealth in their churches and get tens of millions of followers by lying too. No one wants to hear, oh we lost and now we are all going to be slaves to demons but that is literally what is about to happen. No one would listen to me. No one would help me. I am just one man. I couldn't do this on my own but together. Together we could have changed the world. Please share this video. Try and wake people up. Also, you may want to download this video as YouTube will probably delete it and my channel soon.